as, as the civil rights movement matures, you, you get more and more of an ecumenical involvement. And so you're gonna see Eastern Orthodox folks on the front line. You're gonna see some Roman Catholic folks on the front line. Um, you're going to see Jewish persons joining the ranks, um, risking their lives, giving their lives. Um, it, it becomes a fairly ecumenical uh, movement. The question is asked whether or not that's a, a net positive, a good thing, or a net negative, a bad thing. Um, I think in many respects, it's, it's an indifferent thing, right? I'm not sure that it affects the church negatively, um, as, as ecumenism often does. I'm not sure you see the African-American church tilting toward uh, another gospel in that regard. Um, but I do think what we see is um, some, some developed sense of collaboration, of co-belligerency, of alliance forming uh, for the sake of it, I would argue, an obvious positive social good. And that way it's benefit, the ecumenism. Um, it, it, it would not have been possible, I think, for African Americans alone to produce the kind of changes that we saw as a result of the Civil Rights Movement. It, it took a lot of folks stricken in conscience, uh, pierced in heart, who were not African American, to join that movement and say, this is my America too, and uh, we can live up to our best ideals, and we should do what's right. Um, that began to give the, the movement more power, more reach. That, I think, is positive and, and, and instructive. Um, so I don't know that it was that kind of ecumenism strategically it was necessary to the political gains and the social changes. I don't know that it was a, a negative for the church itself. Uh, and I say that because I don't know that I see a lot of people sort of going, hey, you know, we're collaborating with, with Jews and Muslims, let's stop preaching the gospel. I don't know that I see that. Um, and I think we might be in danger of importing today's gospel-centered perspective on everything. We, we might be imported, we might be in danger of, of anachronistically importing that back to a time period that didn't frame these issues in quite that way.